as technologies evolve, people connect. But in education, technology has too often isolated us. Our technology not only connects people, it enhances the classroom experience. Better teaching and learning in a connected digital classroom. So this is an illustration of a network graph with no live classes and links. Even though the instructor is in the US and the students are halfway around the world. So can somebody tell me what a cost might be to get from one students speak and are spoken to. Anyone. Delay. Delay. Delay is a great example. What what causes delay? Lots of things. Bandwidth, for one. That's exactly right, Shuran. You did your homework. Hey, I always do my homework. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> glad you did it this time. The instructor is always visible. So are the slides, both in front of the room and on students' desktops, with language support. Cece, can you come to the board and draw the shortest path? Interactive whiteboards connect everyone electronically. Thank you, that's exactly right. As you can see, the shortest path is not always the least number of hops. Students can raise their hand virtually without interrupting. The instructor the sees of... immediately. Xiang, you have a question? Yes. Cameras provide close-up views of every student. We're going to get into that uh, a lot more in the next lesson. So does that answer your question for now? Yes. OK, great. Polls survey the class instantly. You choose one of these. Is it millions, billions, trillions? And the results are displayed graphically. Several of you think it's millions. That number is probably too low. Deep group discussions are orchestrated by the instructor. In Students submit their group. answers as text or as virtual flip as charts. As soon as you get even eight, eight to ten, they start to become very complex. For us, Distance is not a barrier, it's an opportunity 